Good morning, brothers and sisters. This is Danny from CatcherChrist.net, and today we're going to be memorizing 2 Samuel chapter 6, verse 11. As always, we're going to be using the Scripture Typer Bible Memory System uh, for more in-depth tutorial on how I like to get the most out of this app. From my point of view, please see the first video on this channel's playlist, the playlist that this video is in. But this is the home screen. It's a pretty uh, straightforward app. You're going to hit My Verses. Then you'll select the plus sign at the bottom right hand corner of the screen. You'll select New Verse. And then choose which book of the Bible you'll be in. We'll be in 2 Samuel. Then you'll enter the chapter and verse or verses notation. But just one verse today. You can choose different translations. And you can also choose to categorize your verses into different verse collections. Then you'll select Import Verse Text, and then it should appear below, and then hit Save, and then scroll down to wherever that verse is located. Too far. Second Samuel 6.11. And then you'll start the three-step process. The first step is typing it. You're going to type the first letter only the first letter of each word and the entire word should change from gray to black and I think it's really important to recite the verse as you go along so the ark of the Lord mm -hmm. remained in the house of mm. Obed Edom the Gittite for three months and the Lord blessed him and his entire household 2nd Samuel 6 11 I like to do each step at least three times. The Ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed Edom the Gittite for three months, three months, and the Lord blessed him and his entire household. Second Samuel six eleven. I'm guessing on the pronunciation. Maybe that's what the Hebrew says. Uh, the Ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed Edom the Gittite for three months, and the Lord blessed him and his entire household. 2 Samuel 6.11 So the second step is to memorize it. The app is going to take away half of the words, and now you're essentially filling in the blanks, but you're still going to select, you're still going to type the first letter of each word, even if it's not visible. Uh, the Ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed Edom. The kid died for three months, and the Lord blessed him and his entire household. Second Samuel 6.11 Alright, once again, the ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed-Edom the Gittite for three months, and the Lord blessed him and his entire household. Second Samuel 6.11 And once again, the ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed-Edom the Gittite for three months, and the Lord blessed him and his entire family. Mm. Household. Oops. Six. Second Samuel six eleven. <laughs> and the last step is to master it. Um, as you can see, when you make a mistake on the last two steps, it'll uh, leave behind what's called a heat signature, just to let you know where you made a mistake previously. Um, so let's see. The ark of the Lord remained in the house of Obed Edom, the Gittite, for three months. And the Lord blessed him and his entire household. Second Samuel six eleven. And there you have it. The Second Samuel six eleven in the NIV. Um, so as you can see, we've just done it seven times in a row. If you do it over and over again like this, in a different using different steps, um, I think this is a great way to memorize verses. And the reason I um, encourage others to recite as they go is because after a while, you're going to start to hear your own voice in your own head, or at least I do. Um, and I think that can help you along as well. You also start to visualize the words before you type them. So I think it's a great method. Um, I highly recommend this app. And I always highly recommend that you read verses in context just to get a better understanding of what, you know, is going on in the larger context of the, pa of the passage that the verse is located. Um, don't want to take verses out of context. That can be... Uh, problematic at times but hopefully i'll post some more context about this verse on 
um, the site, catchforchrist.net. But thank you all for watching this video. Have a great day, and God bless.